So this week I'm not going to be doing my regular Tuesday news update um, because as a lot of you guys know um, there was a huge earthquake in Japan and a tsunami that pretty much wiped out Sendai. Um, this is like, this is really terrible and I know that like earthquakes and tsunamis just, you can't, you can't really stop them. So this is really terrible that this happened to Japan. Um, I hope that none of you, like none of my watchers or my viewers were affected. Um, and that your all your friends and family are safe. Um, everyone I know in Japan is okay. Um, most of them live in Osaka, so they really weren't affected. Um, I was actually talking to my friend on Thursday night, who's in Osaka, and we were talking about stupid stuff, and then all all of a sudden he uh, started freaking out that there was an earthquake and it was lasting forever. Um, and I thought it was just normal, because earthquakes are pretty normal in Japan. Um, but then I saw on Twitter that it people in Tokyo felt it too, so I thought that must have been really big. Um, and then just, I, wa I watched on like internet stream um, just the whole situation escalate, and my heart goes out to everybody in Japan, um, and I know you can get through this, um, there are a ton of ways that you, even if you're not in Japan, there are a ton of ways you can help, um, you can donate money to the Red Cross or, um, other organizations. Um, I have a bunch of links where you can uh, donate stuff. Um, and I donated some money, what I could, to um, the Red Cross via text message. Um, and if you... Um, I think the, um, the Johnny's fandom has, like, kind of like pull them together, especially like the Arashi fandom. Um, they have a huge like project auction thing going on right now and they've already raised like six thousand dollars. Um, so I'll give you a link to their post about that. Um, and if you like the cool thing about the um, Arashi auction is that it's not just like they're like, people are auctioning off their, their goods, like their Odyssey and Johnny's related goods, but the people are also offering, um, to like, write fan fiction, or make graphics, and stuff like that for, um, for like, donations, so if you can't, uh, donate yourself, you can offer your services, so other people can donate, um, so there are links, I'll leave a link to the um, Odyssey group for that. Um, there's also a live journal community called Help Japan that is doing pretty much the same thing. Um, so I'll give you links to all that stuff. Um, so yeah, I really, this is a really terrible thing and it's hard to talk about. Because I really don't know what to say. Um, my, right now, like, everybody's freaking out around me um, that I won't be able to go to Japan next week. Um, hopefully I'll be able to go. I'm flying into Osaka, or Kansai International, so um, I don't think I should be affected, but I'm checking my email all the time for any updates for anything um and also let's see what other news is there about this um the japanese entertainment industry 
a lot of artists have set up charities um, and have been donating money. Um, we really haven't heard anything from Johnny's. Um, right now, they've canceled the rest of the concerts for this month, so there's going to be no Johnny's concerts until the end of March. Um, they're either postponing them, I don't think they're canceling them altogether, but they'll probably reschedule them. Um, and Johnny's Net put up, Johnny's Net and J Webb, they put up a, a message the other day saying that um, all their idols are safe. Because um, I know a lot of fans are really worried about them, and it's. I know it was one of the things that I thought about. Um, after, like, I got over, like, the shock, and I made sure all my friends and family and everybody I knew there was safe. I started thinking about what about news like there's kind of a small there's pretty much a small chance that they'd be hurt or anything um because they're all mostly in Tokyo and not really in Sendai um but I was still worried because they're people whose names and faces and personalities that I know and even if they don't know me and don't know that I exist I know that they exist, so, um, but I'm really, I was really thinking about everyone in Japan, um, and today, Johnny's Net and J-Web, I think they put up messages from each group, um, and so if you want to read that, I'll give you, um, I'll try to link to at least the news one, um, I'm trying to find, I found the other ones, but, um, there's some place. But I'll give you a link to the one from news. Um, and what else? Hmm. <laughs> um. Yeah. So hopefully this whole thing solves itself really fast. Japan is strong, and they know what to do in disasters. So hopefully. Um, they recover quickly. Um, daily life in Tokyo and other cities is pretty much back to normal. Um, there's a lot of they're conserving a lot of energy, um, and people in Japan are uh, encouraged to do that. Um, and so. Do what you can. Donating money is probably the best way to help if you're not in Japan. Um, people in Japan can donate things like food and clothing and stuff, but um, it's best for international people outside of Japan to uh, donate money so that Japan can use it in the way that they they need to use it. Um, and but if you can't. If you can't donate any money, and I understand that some people aren't in the position to the, to do that, there's just offering your thoughts and prayers to Japan is is a good way to support just support them. Um, there are several support projects on the internet. Um, one of them is the Warate Japan project. It's on Facebook, and it's just a Facebook group where people are making signs and. Uh, of just encouragement to Japanese people. Um, so, um, yeah, so, Kanbare Nippon, you can do it. I know you can. So, um, I will probably see you guys next week. Or, actually, I'm leaving next week, so I'll make up another video before I leave. Um, I guess I'll see you guys later. Bye!